Oh, do I got it? There we go. Yo, sorry. <laughs> Yo, it's JSF. Um, so I just played a set. I just played a set, and it made me. It reminded me about this. This video is long overdue. This video is long overdue, and I'm to the Jade fans. I am sorry. Um, I think Jade is a cool character. Uh, in, in the lore, aesthetic wise, I think she's beautiful, all that good shit. But Jade is wow, trash yeah. in this game. Like, trash, not meaning that she's bad. This is a set I just played against a Jade player, uh, combat league, whatever. Um, I think Jade is the scrubbiest character in this game. No, I'm just gonna say it. Jade is the scrubbiest character in this game, bar none. I think that's cut and dry. You can argue Kung Lao, you can argue Fujin. But I think Jade, especially Emerald Defender, like I don't know if y'all follow my Twitter, shameless plug, at your boy JSF. <laughs> but I tweeted not even less than a month ago, I wanna say. I don't respect any Emerald Defender Jade players. Cause it's all it's zoning, but like it's it's bullshit zoning. It's zoning that shouldn't be the way it is, right? To me. It's bullshit zoning and it's gimmicks after that. All, after that it's just gimmicks. All you Jade players look. Random super because you're a fucking Jade player. All you do is down four, shadow kick, zone, and glow, and like that's it. Like, I'm, it's very, very rare. And I'm not gonna say I've never. I've seen some good Jaded Jade players. I have. I've seen like two Jaded Jade players who actually like got some shit. And I'm like, okay, you kind of know how to play. And I think I lost to one or two of them like a couple of times. And I was like, okay, nah, he, he knows a couple of things, right? But Emerald Defender Jade is literally just zoning and bullshit. And not to say that zoning means you're trash or you don't know how to play because you zone. Because I zone. I I, I play Frost, bro. <laughs> you know what I mean? I play Robocop. Like, so I'm not saying, oh, because you're zoning, you're, you're bad. You suck because you're you're just spamming and doing keep away moves. No, not at all. Look, this is the zoning game that we're playing. I'm rolling with it. I'm losing, but I always have a plan. I play Frost, bro. I have a plan. I can lose. The, like, 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 if you didn't see the first round, I did my super. The beauty of playing Frost, if you get in the zoning war, I don't need to win. I don't need to life lead. All I need to do is get you to 33% health. I don't need the life lead. All I need to do is get you to 33% health. Uh, I, I, I range you. GG. <laughs> I don't. So I don't want people to think that I have a, a issue. I can't beat Jade. Uh, I just super this character fucking makes me super salty. She does, but she's just super, 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 super scrubby. Like we're gonna watch the other the other match in this set. And I might go into uh, training mode and show some shit too. But Jade, as in as a whole, Jade's a scrubby character, right? The way she's designed is to be a bullshit character. She's not. She has gotten better. I will say that. She's gotten better. She's been bad for a long time. She's gotten better now. She might be solid now, but she doesn't have like the traditional shit that makes a character really good. But she got bullshit. She has bull in every variation she has bullshit. Right? Like she usually has the glow, so you can't hit her with projectiles. Her fucking air projectiles plus on block. Like her EX air glaive is plus. If I'm not mistaken, I'll, I will check it. I will fact check that. But I'm pretty sure it's plus on block, which is fucking stupid because no other air projectile in the game is plus on block. <laughs> you know what I mean? So it's like they found weird, quirky ways to make her like to give her shit instead of just making her a good character. And what what annoys me is she has good buttons, right? Or she has long range buttons, I would say. Like she has a, what is it, a nine or 10 frame high that has really good range, her wiggle stick. She has other buttons, she has her overheads that like are super slow, right? They're super slow, but they have extremely good range. And sometimes, I'm, I'm not even gonna lie, sometimes I don't even know I'm in the range of her overheads. And other times I can't react because it's online. Boom, out footsie. Uh, she has a really good down four, but the problem with that is J players are scrub, so they just mash down four all the time. And you can't just mash. This is why my combo didn't come out. Yeah. And I almost lost this. Like, literally, my game winning combo didn't come out. <laughs> that sucks, right? It's online. It, it is what it is. But no. Like, the, the downside to her having a good down four is her fucking, um... Our players, the people who play J just mash down four. It's like a shadow kick. They just do shadow kick all the fucking time. Look, try to go for crushing blows. No, it should have blocked after because it's not your turn. That didn't work, but whatever. <laughs> you know what I mean? That should have worked. It was a combo, whatever. Cool. A little butterfly kick. You're not blocking, so you get hit with an overhead into a mid. Like, I'm not doing anything. Look, 
That's just a restand setup. You just didn't block. Then you got out footsie. I thought I had crush and blow, but I already used it. Spin. I'm going to EX it. And you're dead at this point. That's fine, but you're dead. Look. I think he supers me too, yeah. I'm low blocking for whatever reason. Don't know why. I'm not going to lie. Like, I didn't get hit. I definitely got hit, but I was low blocking. <laughs> I think because I default to low blocking when I want to fall his spot, but he never finished that string, even though it's plus. But it is when he got on the mic and started talking shit, which you can't see in the video. Oh, it's not going to show it, yeah. He he got on the mic and started talking trash, so I got on the mic and started talking trash and fatality. Um, but no, Jade. Let's get back to this character, fucking Jade. Because we need to talk about Jade. We need to talk about Jade. We need to talk about Jade. The way this character is designed is fucked up. She's not broken. She's not top tier. I don't think she's super good or anything. She's passable. I think you can go through the... I think if you play Jaded Jade, I think if you pick Jaded Jade and you're a good player and you exploit the bullshit of this game, you can reach Elder Guy with Jaded Jade. You can't do it with Frost. Frost is not that kind of character. Frost is not good enough, right? Jade is it's possible to do. Jade has... Look, I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you. And I'm not... Look, I understand how... I understand how Jade can be fun to play against. I told I mean to play and not play against God no. I understand how Jade can be fun to pick. I get it. I'm not here to just say fuck every Jade main. I understand how you could have reasons to want to play her, but I just want y'all to know your character is fucking scrubby. She's the scrubbiest character in the game. Literally the only arguments that I want to hear outside of Jade are what Kung Lao, Raiden and uh fucking Fujin, and they're all the same character. Those are all the same character. Fujin doesn't have a teleport, but he might as well. Kung Lao and Raiden both do. They just mash pokes and shit. Fujin doesn't even do that. He just flies, right? So Jade, right? Like I said, like I said, um, and, and here's the funniest part about it all. It doesn't matter where her shit is on block. It doesn't matter because nobody, nobody cares. What is this on block? Minus five? Guess what? They're going to do it again. And it's got pushback. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Look how much pushback that has. This button is great. It low, pro it low profiles everything. I'm not trying to do Shadow King. It low profiles everything. God damn. It low profiles everything. Pushes you back. It's minus five. It reset. If I do it from point blank range, a neutral is reset. <laughs> We're back at round star. Look. Damn near. If I do it from here, literally same shit. Like, right? Like, in the, the, the J player that I played, he didn't do this one time. And then he started talking shit about me. He didn't do this one time. When he did this string, whoa. When he did this string, he never finished it, right? Never finished it to get the plus frames. I know there's a gap. What is the string? That? Yeah. And that part is minus seven. The 11 frame mid is minus fucking two. The 11 frame mid is minus fucking two. If you wonder why I'm saying that like that. Because this is minus eight and it pushes me back. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like, and what kills me about Jade players is there's other ways to play Jade. There's ways to play Jade. Like, you have a brain. But Jade players decide to default to, nah, I'm a Shadow Kick down to Air Glaive, uh, Glow, this shit. And that's it. And, like, yeah, you're going to use a, you're going to use a projectile. Cool. You're going to use a projectile. Cool. I'm not, like, knocking you for it, but I'm not giving you points for that, right? <clears throat> That's trying to zone me out, keep me away. When I get in about this range, what the fuck do you do? Most J players is just down four. All they know is down four. All you know, down four. Get your space to go back to zoning. Fam, you have so many more options from this range. You have this. You have this. You have this. Right? 15 frame mid that goes into an overhead. Boom. Mid that you can put into a low. Boom. Yeah, I know it's unsafe, but of minus 20 from here. I mean, I could punish it. I could not. Online, you never know. It is a legitimate mix-up. Both options are technically unsafe, but depending on the character, if you space it out, unless it's like uh, Sub-Zero or Liu Kang, like, like against Frost, right? What the fuck is Frost gonna do? Watch. I'm gonna show you. Because I always play Frost against uh, against uh, Jade. And I know some people are like, oh, you say counterpicking is trash. But every time you see a Jade player, you pick Frost. That's a counterpick. First off, two things. One, I'm a Frost main. I'm a day one Frost main. I'm not somebody who decided to play Frost when I found out I hate fighting Jade. 
no, that that's not me. Like, I'm a day one Frostman. This is my character, the first character I played. I only play like four to five characters in this game. I, I can't counter pick you and just pick Kung Lao because I don't know that character, right? Also, fuck Jade. <laughs> She's the scrubbiest character in the game. So if I do, if I if there's one character in the game that I'm gonna counter pick, I don't mind that it's Jade. I don't care. I, I'll take that. I will take that L and say, you know what? I do counter pick against this one character out of fucking thirty. I'll I'll take that in stride. I'm totally okay with that. And I'm sorry if y'all disagree with that, but you gotta understand this shit is super 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 scrubby. Like I, if all you play is Emerald Defender Jade, you get zero respect for me. Now, look, this this right is the optimal punish. Start up 17 frames. Now, well, look at that. You see that? <laughs> you see what just happened right there? It's the optimal punish. Right? Oh, I'm trying to fucking... Nah, that's not what I'm trying to do. Damn. I'm really bad with this character. Yeah. You try to do it too early, you get hit with some of that. If I, if I just fucking do this at this range... You know what I mean? It's not like... It's not always as guaranteed as you think it would be. So then it becomes... A question mark like if you if you get caught off guard and she does this shit you need to question the range before you just do the reversal right because if she does it point blank yeah if if jay does anything point blank range is punishable we know that but if it's any type of mid-range shit like this then you gotta wonder and then you gotta wonder do i want to risk my fucking neck doing this doing what doing this move and getting what eight percent damage and if i spend meter 14 percent but this is the shit Jade players don't think about most of the time, right? Most of the time, and here's why I'm shitting on Jade players, because a lot of you motherfuckers don't think. You just don't, bro. You don't. You don't. Like, sure, if you do this, like, you, a lot of y'all just do a down to shadow kick. Like, if you do shadow kick in neutral, I have zero respect for you, bro. It's just not safe. Minus 19. Boom. Minus 18. It's not safe. It's not fucking safe. It's never safe. Shadow kick. It's never safe. <laughs> if you do shadow kick in neutral, that's just like doing sub zero slide in neutral. Like doing nomad dash in neutral. Any other fuck neutral move, it's super scrubby. Like the tools, and it's a good tool. It's a good tool to get a knockdown or whatever. And the crushing blow is do it twice in a row. They're encouraging you to spam shadow kick. That's the developer. That's the developer encouraging you. Where are we at? Blazing nitro kick twice in a row or breaks armor they're encouraging you to do this twice in a row that's fucking scrubby you cannot tell me this character is not scrubby when the character is designed to encourage you to do their fuck neutral special move twice in a row like you can't tell me that bro. you can't like you can't this shit is nonsense Fucking Jade's glow against Frost is not real because her ice bomb blows that shit the fuck up. And half of you motherfuckers glow and just jump in the air like you're safe. You're not fucking safe, bro. You can't block in the air. <laughs> and, and my ice bomb blows up your glow. Like, you, it's not safe. Like, it's just a bunch of... Like, the zoning is a zoning, right? I'm not mad at the zoning. If you can zone really well with Jade, hey, more power to you. The guy I played was... Better at zoning than a lot of the J players I run into. But when that gets shut down and you have no other option besides down four when you get in here, you're a fucking scrub. And then they always get mad at me for beating you. It's like, no, I'm exposing you because you don't know how to fucking play. Learn how to play. I will learn Jade and do a Jade guide to teach you Jade players how to play. I will teach you how to play Emerald Defender Jade. I, I, get, I can do it. <laughs> I can, I'm can. i here. It's me. It's I. Yo soy. <laughs> I'm here. <laughs> like I'm telling you like I can teach you how to play Emerald Defender Jade. She is not a character that's out of my realm of usage I know how to zone really well. I know how to use neutral buttons really well, right? Here's the thing J players don't get bro. She's got but like what's hold on. What's the string on this? I don't even know it. What's the string on back to hold on. We about to find out but I find out Oh, there's no string on back to it's just a one hit hit confirm And then you confirm it to that, it's a shadow kick. Alright, whatever. And you can confirm it to this instead. What is this shit on hit? Plus 10. So you can do wiggle stick. You don't even need to hit confirm that. You can do this into wiggle stick. If it hits, you're plus 14, right? Then you go into some shit like this, right? You can if you want. Depending on your fucking situation, right? 
Or you can uh, press. I always do that. Or you can do some shit like. And then they're gonna have to hold that. It's blockable, yeah. But they're gonna have to hold this button. And you know what this button is on block? Minus two. It's a stagger. I can finish the whole string. I mean, I can finish the whole. If she's gonna fucking do it. I can finish the whole string. Be plus five. Or I can just. Or I can just do. Three hits, be minus seven, it's still a stagger, right? Uh or or I can uh 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 into a into a special, right? I can do that. Or into a low special, right? I I I have options, right? Like Jade has tools to pressure people. She does. She has low, that's minus four on block. This string is whatever. Um second hit is minus five, it's a stagger. Special cat. I've never seen a J player do the second hit of this. Special cancel it. I've never seen them do this and just throw me. Like, she has options on offense that I never see any Jade players doing. Now, Jade has even better pressure because she has plus frames and it gets even better. That's a better variation than this character. This variation is just zoning and nonsense. Variation 2 is the best one. Well, not as good zoning, but I can I can be good with this. I can pick I can pick Emerald Defender Jade. I can pick this variation. This is Emerald Defender Jade, and be good with it and beat people with it and teach y'all how to play it. I guarantee it. I guarantee it. I can teach 99% of J players how to be a better J player. Not to mention they're fucking down to minus nine. <laughs> it's hilarious. But um, no, I'm serious. Like, I I I I, I understand why, but I don't understand why when it doesn't work. If you're able to fraud people out with Jade all the time, I get it. I get it. It's like Luke Kang, right? You can pick Luke Kang, mash buttons, whatever the fucking buttons are, right? You just press shit, press shit, whatever. You're Luke Kang. All saw mids. Look at this shit. A 18 frame mid that hits from here. Special cancelable? Hold on. Of course it is. Of course it is. Into that, right? That has a gap in it. It's plus seven, but it has a gap. Definitely has a gap. Then it's the mind game of, am I going to amplify it or not? And you got to wait for me. You don't have to wait for me. You can just press fucking buttons. You can. But then I don't have to do it. I can just B minus four and do whatever the fuck I want after. Like, look at the low, look at the low block advantage, or I guess high block advantage, all her shit, right? Minus four. Fucking minus two. Fucking... Minus four, like, those are all really, really good staggers. Like, I'm playing Frost. You know what I'm doing to people? I'm playing Frost, and I'm staggering with this. Minus four from this range. I'm trying to fucking, I'm trying to get something off of this. Minus nine. You know what I mean? I'm trying to stagger off minus 12. People trying to stagger off that. Like, you know what I mean? I'm trying to fly in with this high. Like, I'm, like, I'm trying to figure shit out and make it work. And other characters, even worse, right? Fucking spawn, I'm trying to stagger off some shit that's minus 11. And you telling me Jade has shit minus 2, minus 4, minus 4. Like, what do we, what the fuck are we talking about? And if they start to know that you're gonna fucking, that you're gonna stagger, then you go into other shit. Go on to Shadow Kick, you motherfuckers are doing Shadow Kick in neutral anyway. Go on to low projectile, so they have to low block. They have to respect it eventually, right? Like, get, you know what I mean? Go on to glow, go into something. <laughs> Maybe not glow, but you get the point, right? It just, every, not every, but 99% of J players decide to take the scrubbiest route to play this character. All of them. And I'm not just talking about random online J players who have no aspirations of trying to do anything competitive. I'm like, you motherfuckers are trying to rank up in combat league. You're playing a thousand matches in combat league. And you play this character the scrubbiest fucking way. Like, you do. That's a fact. Like, none of you guys have any fucking clue how to play this character. I can't stand this character. And I can... I guarantee you, if I spent... Uh, four, three, four hours with Jade... In the lab and in matches... I can tell you guys how to play her better than you know how to play her. And y'all been playing her for a year. You know what I mean? This this character is just stupid. Stop designing characters like this, Netherrealm, please. Stop telling me to do two shadow kicks in a row. It's scrubby as fuck. Um, shit needs to be minus 30 before the amplify, minus 30 after the amplify. I should be able to dash up and fucking punish. Whatever. It should be super de duper unsafe. I, it should never be a question. She should not be able to shout. She should not be able to shout. And she has a pit. Fair, fair. She got parry too. Here's another thing. When I play Frost, you know what I do? J players are mashing down four. 
guess what I'm doing that look well I'm gonna show you I'm gonna show you look look this is what I really do against Jay that's what I really do against Jay and this is what Jay players really don't do to me like Jay players just don't do it they just don't Emerald Defender Jay players just don't do it I'm I was shocked to see an Emerald Defender player use a pair I was shocked <laughs> you know what I mean like this character is scrubby as fuck I don't, I don't care what anybody says I don't care if y'all disagree with me Jade had like this is why I talk so much shit about this game and the people who play it is because a lot of these characters like I've said about Kung Lao before he had there's a way to play Kung Lao like you have a brain but Netherrealm's dumbass gives you the option to play him the brainless way, and they encourage you to play him the brainless way, just like Raiden. They encourage you to play him that way, and then that becomes the norm. It, it, it fucking takes away from the potential neutral of the game. Like, can you imagine if people, like, I don't give a fuck if nobody plays Raiden, if nobody plays Jade or Kung Lao, but I liked it better when Raijin Raiden was, like, the better option. But just nobody played him. No, oh, he's bad. He's bad. No, he's not bad. You're bad. You are bad at this game. You're trash. And that's why I say that to people. And it sounds harsh or it sounds like trolly or it sounds whatever. But it's the truth. Like, I will tell people, yo, you're trash. You should just learn how to play. Just learn how to play, bro. Just learn. I won't be angry at them. I'll just be like, yo, you should just learn how to play. Just, I promise if you just learn how to play, it'll take you further in this game. It will. It will. And I'm not saying I've gotten to the fucking top of the mountain. But if I want to every season of Elder God, I can reach God rank without tearing my head off my shoulders. I could reach Elder God if I decided to play different characters. That's what holds me back. I play fucking Spawn. Uh, I don't play enough Joker. Or I don't play the right variation of Joker. Um, I play Robocop, who has issues. I play Frost, who's the worst character Frost, in Frost, the Frost. game. If anyone's wondering, this is the worst character in the game. No, you're not getting that Shao Kahn shit off anymore. He was never that bad. You guys didn't have the character's DLC, or you didn't know how to play. Now, I'm just saying, I, I this video is about Jade, man. Just please, Netherrealm, don't ever design a character like this again, please. Don't design a character around scrubbiness. Because you design her Emerald Defender around zoning, but then you give her... Stop designing zoning anti-zoners. I should have started the video with this. Oh, man. Just stop designing zoning anti-zoners. Stop, stop, stop. Get rid of it. Get rid... Cut that idea out of your brain. If your character is going to be an anti-zoner, don't make them a zoner. You know who should be an anti-zoner? Fucking... Who in this game? Who should be an anti-zoner? Sonya's a fucking zoning anti-zoner. Jackie. Jackie should be an anti-zoner in this game. I think she's the only character in this game with no form of a fireball in two of her variations. Um, she should be an anti-zoner. You can make Devorah an anti-zoner. She's got a teleport. She doesn't have real zoning to really give a fuck about, right? Give her that. But instead, you give us Shiva. You give us Shiva, a character who has a really good fireball. Her fireball is like spawns, but her EX fireball is better than his. I think hers is faster and hers has a much bigger hitbox. You can't low profile her EX fireball. So she has good zoning when she has meter. You have to respect her zoning game. You do. Now, most Shiva players can't zone because they play her for gimmicks, but she has it. And then she also has fucking stomp, which means she gets in free with an unblockable move. Stop designing characters like this. Stop. Stop giving us zoning anti-zoners. No, bro. Give us a z Jade can be a zoner. That's fine. But when she ha has all her zoning tools, don't give her glow. You guys take away glow when she gets to teleport, but not when she has fucking air projectile as plus on block, anti-air projectile, and low projectile. Like, huh? When her zoning gets amplified fucking three times over, you still give her her move that you can't hit her with projectiles? Like, what? And then when you try to approach her, because you have to approach her, if you can't zone her, if you don't have a move that can hit her, you have to approach her. And if you don't have a teleport, you have to approach her. And then you get outranged by her. Like, it's why she's so polarizing. It's why Jade has so many matchups where she can dominate other characters even though she's not that good. Right? It's why she can dominate Spawn even though Spawn does 40% per combo and she does 20%. 
because he can't from full screen, mid screen, he can't touch her. He literally can't hit her. He literally cannot touch. That's why when people pick Jade against me when I play spawn, I'm like, okay, I know what you're doing. Like that matchup is like an eight-two matchup. Like he literally, when she has glow, there's nothing he can do. Nothing. And once he starts approaching, her buttons either outrange his or have the same range, right? <clears throat> and it like it, it for her. It makes her either dominate characters or lose the characters. <clears throat> and she has decent buttons up close too. Like she still has shit. Like I'm, there's one more thing I want to see. There's one more thing I want to see. Robocop. And it's not what Robocop is. It's about Jade. Retro I'm pretty game. sure. And this is gonna take five seconds. I'm pretty sure I know the answer to this, but I just want to check it real quick. I, I like to be informed when I talk my shit. I like to be informed. <laughs> I like to know what I'm talking about when I talk. Because if people disagree with me, that's fine. Everybody's entitled to your opinion. Feel free to disagree. Get in the comments below. Subscribe if you're fucking with the content. I appreciate y'all. But no, if you disagree, that's fine, man. I'm not mad at people for disagreeing with me. Seven frame down one. Some of the best zoning in the game. Seven frame down one. Now, can somebody uh, look at the range of her down one? It's not, not abysmal, right? Not abysmal, right? It's not like it's super duper trash. Eight frame, eight frame down three that hits low. Ten frame down four. Obviously hits low. Now why does Frost have to have an eight frame down one? Why can't Frost get a seven frame down one? Somebody explain it to me. Somebody explain it to me. Just somebody make it make sense to me. When Jade has some of the fucking best zoning. The only reason Frost can shut down Jade's zoning is because she can get through the glow. It's literally the, literally the only reason. If J players stop fucking jumping in the air and thinking they're invincible and doing shit like that, then they'll be alright. Then they can zone back with Frost. And the uh, homeboy that I just played against was kind of zoning back, right? But anyway, it, I, I just wanted to talk about some of the more egregious shit. I think this is ridiculous. I think Jade is a very, very abusable character. And I think the skill ceiling to abuse Jade is very low. Right? I don't think you need to know very much about playing this game to be able to pick Jade. Look, mine is, you see that? Just tell me you see it. Just tell me you see it. <laughs> I think the skill ceiling to be able to use Jade in an abusable manner is very low. And I think that's a problem. I think abusable care. You can have good characters. If you want Jade to just be good, make her good. You guys wanted the designer to be this character who doesn't do combos for some stupid ass reason when your game is based around doing combos. Like that doesn't make any sense, stop. I understand creativity. I'm here for creativity. I'm all about creativity. I got my own ideas, I got a million of them. I wanna make my own fighting game. I totally get it. But to say in this game, <laughs> And they almost did the same thing with Robocop. You want you want fucking your character to just be like zoning, footsies, but never ever do a combo. And then turn around and make Cassie Cage, who has zoning and footsies and combo damage. <laughs> and then turn around, like is it just doesn't make any and then turn around and make Frost, who has zoning and footsies. <laughs> We can do combo damage <laughs> and can get through Jade's glow. Like it's just bad game design, man. It just is. It just is. And I'm not. I hope my tone doesn't come off as angry or anything like that. Cause I'm not mad. I just think it's funny, and I think it's something that we should talk about. I think it's something because I've been. You know how I feel about Jade. That's not new. How I feel about Jade is nothing new. It's nothing new. It's nothing new. Y'all been knowing how I felt about Jade. Y'all done known. Y'all know what's up. But it's just. This shit gotta stop, bro. This shit's been going on since maybe MK9. It's definitely been going on since Injustice 1. We got characters like fucking Batgirl to have some of the best zoning in the game. But, oop, you can't zone them, though. And when you try to get close, guess what? I got you. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, and it's not like Jade is some unbeatable boss character. Because you just saw me pick Frost and just whoop any Jade's player's ass. Like, I'm very confident in my Frost against Jade players. I'm very confident in my Frost against every J player on the fucking planet. Yeah, there's probably three of them that can beat me, but the rest of you guys are going to get washed because you have no footsies, you have no neutral, your zoning's not even that good, and your pressure's trash, and there's holes in your, and, and then there's holes in your zone, in your pressure, right? There's holes in your pressure that I know about, and I'm ready to exploit. 
I can flawless block. Oh, I don't even need to up to that. I can just flawless block jab punish it. Hold up. Mm, not with frost. Not with frost. Not with frost. <laughs> not with frost. That's the other thing we gotta talk about. One day we gotta talk about jabs and jab ranges and, and mids and mid ranges. Cause look at look at her mid. If you have an advancing mid string, it's really good. Look at this shit. What does this do? What damage does this do? Just cur out of curiosity. 18%. Eh, nothing crazy. Hold on. But you can do... Yeah, you can do 18% into a restand. It's plus 10. Yeah, like... Fam. Like, the way I play Robocop... You can really just do with Jade. Like, the way I play... Oh, I don't have the right... I don't have the right variation. Hold on, give me one second. And here's the thing, right? Like, y'all see me play Robocop, right? Where I do zone people out. Of course I do. That's one of the character's biggest strengths. I zone people out with Robocop. You have to. That's, that's part of how you play him. He has this. He has this. He has this. Uh, he's, you know, he's got, he's got this. He's got his shit, right? But, like, you see me do this a lot with Robocop, right? And I'm plus 17 or whatever the fuck. You have to hold whatever I do next. You know what I mean? You gotta do a little dash up or whatever. Or I just do 4 or 2, which is 13 frames. You gotta hold that shit. Now, Jade shit isn't that good. But that's plus 10. I mean, that's the wrong button, but you get the idea, right? <laughs> this is an 11 frame button, and I'm plus 10. Like, it's it's the same fucking mix-up. It's the same pressure that I use with Robocop, but just J J players do it sometimes. And they might go back into this, or they fucking get greedy and try to go in. No, that's not it. Or they get fucking greedy and try to go into some shit like this. And I'm like, fam, that's not real. Like, go into your 11 frame mid or go into your throw. It's a strike throw. It's a guaranteed strike throw mix. Take it as that. Stop trying to get weird and greedy with the pressure and take what you have, right? But, like I said, if I can, I can do a Jade guide. I guarantee you. <laughs> I can teach the J players how to play J, but I'm gonna go do that if people want me to do it or if I just change my mind and want to do it or feel like I should do it because she's not too far from my playstyle. I just hate the way people play this character. They've soured this character for me. When I first saw Jade, I was like, ooh, like I played Morphle Katana in MKX. I don't know if I've ever said that before. I played Mournful Katana in, MK in MKX. I played the Scorpion, Inferno, and Ninjutsu. <clears throat> I put a little bit of Marksman Aaron Black. Um, I hated the way they designed Aaron Black in that game. I hated it. He didn't have a fireball. <clears throat> but every now and then I would dabble. Um, I played Triborg, Cyber Sub-Zero. Um, and I played more for Katana. I think that was it. I think that was it. Yeah, I played the Jade variation of Katana. She had the Shadow Kick. She had the Glaive. She had the Air Glaive. I played the character. So don't get it twisted like I don't know shit about Jade. I know Jade. <laughs> but anyway, this video is probably getting too long. Um, I could talk about this shit a lot longer. Like I said, if y'all want me to get, y'all want me to do the Jade guide, let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments. I would do in the Emerald. I would do an all variations guide of Jade like I have with other characters. I have. I will. What is what is the optimal on this? That's probably it right there. <laughs> Uh, wait, hold on. We gonna get this. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, no. Come on. I want to get this at least once. Come on. There we go. Okay, okay. I got it. I got it. I got it now. I got it now. Bruh. <laughs> uh, uh. There we go. That's the optimal. All right. Um, just wanted to do that real quick. <laughs> Anyway, um, I'm gonna get up out of here. I appreciate y'all for watching. If you do like the video, shoot me a like. Uh, subscribe if you like the content. I should probably say that stuff in the beginning of the video, huh? I don't know, man. <laughs> but anyway, JSF, I'm gonna get out of here. If y'all want the J guy, let me know. Oh, I'm here for it. But I feel like we need to talk about this character. If you describe this character in the game, Netherrealm, stop it. Y'all know what y'all doing. Don't fucking Justice 3 up. <laughs> That's all these videos is just telling you don't fucking Justice 3 up. Or whatever you're doing next. But anyway, I'm out of here. Peace.